Hey guys, it's the Swirl Cloth here, and today in Service Monster Legends Weeks, we have all the leaked events for this week, as well as the main event for next week, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so, first of all, the main event for next week is going to be the Mudster Tails, that is, we're going to get this monster right here, which I believe is named Mudster, and he looks okay, he's probably one of the worst designs out of the new monsters that we've seen so far, but yeah, he still looks okay, I guess. And of course, he's going to be in a Tails Challenge, and yeah, Tails Challenges do cost gems, so unless you really, really want him, you don't really have to worry about this event. But he doesn't seem too bad, he is a pretty good monster, I guess. So I guess he wouldn't be bad to get. So yeah, definitely go ahead and try to get him next week on a Friday, and if you want to go ahead and rank him up, start collecting tokens next week on Monday. And now let's move into this week's events. Alright, so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday are all actually exactly the same. They all have the Maze Island, the Z Sparks Challenge, and the Top Breeding. So the Maze Island is great. You can get a bunch of free stuff out of that. Not even just Mythics. You can get, like, a bunch of food, gold. You can get Relics out of it. And you can also get the new chests. So definitely keep an eye out for those as well. So make sure to do the Maze Island no matter what, even if you don't want the new monster. And then the Z Sparks Challenge is pretty good as well if you need him for books. It's not good if you don't need him for books since of course it will cost gems so yeah if you want to go and spend gems and get z sparks go ahead and then the top reading is great you can get a bunch of free mythics no gems needed you just get free mythics so out of these three events definitely do the maze and then the top reading and i would definitely do some research on the z sparks challenge to see if you really need him and then on a friday a brand new marathon starts so definitely make sure to try to find a good team by friday so that you can participate in that and also the collector's breeding starts which is pretty great you can get some great mythics out of that and the guest were an alchemistic path start so neither of those monsters are really too great but if you need them for books you can definitely go and try to get them but yeah the main two events for friday saturday and sunday actually that you want to focus on are the marathon and the collector's breeding and if you are going to do the paths make sure to do them before sunday because they're no longer going on on sunday so yeah those are pretty much all the events for this week as well as the main event for next week definitely focus on the maze island and the marathon since those are the two main events and then of course the breeding events are great and then as far as the challenge and the paths go only do them if you need the monsters for books don't really worry about them otherwise but yeah the two main events maze island marathon and then the breeding events are the best and then next week on Monday, start collecting tokens for the Taylor's Challenge. And then next week on Friday, you can start getting the monster. So yeah, that is what we have for this video. Let me know down in the comments which events you guys are most excited for and which events you guys are going to be doing. And I see you in the next one. Over to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.